guys it's 2 p.m and i was really busy with work this morning so i just didn't make my morning coffee and i'm having my first coffee right now and i'm just so tired <laughs> i'm really soaking in this coffee and i gotta get back to work but i just wanted to show you all that caffeine is amazing and dangerous at the same time and hoping you guys all get your good night's sleep so cheers to that hi guys happy friday today you are gonna join me as i venture to the amazing place called in and out and we're gonna get some in and out i haven't got it in a long time i'm pretty sure i haven't had it since the summer it's probably somewhere in the past vlogs and so i think i'm gonna get a burger and some animal fries also quick update uh this beautiful hair is leaving me tomorrow i'm getting a haircut and probably gonna cut it short so might as well record uh this farewell to my hair okay guys let's go to in and out <laughs> Saturday and I just picked up lunch for me and Phil today. I it's like my embarrassing moments just never end. Our lunch took about 20 minutes to make and they're like a small local Korean restaurant and so they didn't have like DoorDash or um, no like online ordering so I had to kind of just like go there and like order it and wait for it. So I went, I was like, okay, you know what? 20 minutes is quite a while, so let me go pick up some coffee. So I go to this coffee shop and I ordered some mochi donuts, I ordered some coffee, and I was like, all right, this is the perfect way to just kill time. And my coffee comes out and I also ordered a drink for Phil. And the barista was like, oh, would you like a tray carrier for your drinks? And I was like, no, like I'm gonna be fine. Like it's only two drinks and like a box of donuts. Like I can totally carry that myself. And right as I take my drink and walk out the door, I spill my coffee at the front entrance everywhere. It's such an I told you so moment. And so I went back and I was like, so about that tray carrier. <laughs> And he was really generous enough to give me another coffee even though that was my mess up. Uh, so that is my embarrassing story of the day. I am getting a haircut today guys and I asked people on my Instagram, should I do like a shortcut? Should I just do a trim, mid length? Like what should I do? And based on the popular results, I'm just gonna go with that because it's COVID so like why not? It's not like a lot of people have to look at my hair nowadays anyways. And I am just so tired with the uh, condition of my hair right now. And so you guys will see what I end up getting for my haircut later. Not excited about it because he's a basic guy who just thinks girls need to have long hair. What? I never said that. But I think I asked people on Instagram, and I think we're gonna be cutting it pretty short. Tune in. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
Hi guys! So you probably just saw my shortcut. I love it so much and my head feels so much lighter and I am finally home. It's been quite a day and I just feel like I'm ready to unplug for the rest of the day. So I just thought I would pop in and say hi. I think it can be scary for a lot of people to do really short hair but I feel like just go for it, especially like nowadays when everyone's staying at home. This is the best time to try new things. I've always been really a big advocate of just chopping off all my hair and I love it so much. So yeah guys, talk to you guys soon. Sushi Oda, which is this really oh, amazing really sushi place in San Diego. I think it's the best one. Thank you so much. No problem. <laughs> and we also got extraordinary cake, which we're gonna eat soon. And we got some boba. And it's Phil's time to open his ginormous gift. It's so big, guys. I can't even explain to you how big it is. What is this? <laughs> what is this? Oh, it's all for Everlane. Yeah. Oh. It's a whole outfit. Actually, uh, <laughs> oh, you're so you're guessing me. <laughs> you always wanted jean jacket, oh. so I got you a jean jacket, and oh. then your black jeans were ripping, so I got you jeans. <laughs> <laughs> and then this is just a button up to tie oh, it all thank together. You so much. Yeah. Happy birthday! Thank you. Everyone say happy birthday to Phil! <laughs> Thank you! We're gonna have some creme brulee. We've got a chocolate cheesecake and a ricotta orange cake from Extraordinary Desserts. We have creme brulee. Oh, There's actual gold on here too. Oof. Edible gold. Mm. It's fancy. Okay. Cheers! Mmm! Mm. Is this edible? Mm-hmm. Everything is edible. Yes, you you don't have to eat the flour though. I want to try. Okay. It just tastes like flour. Mm. Yeah. It's not a birthday cake. It's birthday creme brulee. Mm. His birthday and Valentine's Day are the same week, but I have to write two cards. <laughs> <laughs> How do you write two cards in one week? I'll just copy and paste. Okay. All right, guys. Good night. This Happy Meal is the summation of exactly what my childhood is. Pokemon and McDonald's all wrapped in one. And this has been so exciting for people. But it's because of these little Happy Meal toys that come with it. Uh, they're wrapped in this really beautiful red envelope. And I think there's some Pokemon cards in here. So we're going to unbox this together. Just open the flap. And we have a little wrapped up Pokemon card. We have, oh my God. Oh, we have some stickers, oh my God. It's so cute. There's a Chikorita, Cyndaquil, Pikachu, Totodile. And then my second one here, we're gonna open this like that. And we have another hidden Pokemon card. And let's see if these stickers are this. <gasps> these are Pokemon from the newer generation that I didn't really play growing up. So I actually don't really know who these Pokemon are. I wish I got like the OG generation with like Charmander, Bulbasaur, and Squirtle. Here is the best part. We're going to open up these packages and see which Pokemon cards we got. And to be honest, to save the worth, I shouldn't unopen it, but let's be real, I'm not gonna sell these, I'm gonna keep it for myself. Oh, guys, there's multiple cards. Oh my gosh. 
There's four cards in each of these packages. That's so insane. I got this Chikorita, got a uh, Piplup, which is actually the starter Pokemon I used when I played um, Platinum. And Chespin, I think it's one of those Pokemons that I haven't met because it's a newer generation. And Mudkip, which is also the Pokemon I used to start when I uh, played Ruby. Guys, I'm sorry if I'm nerding out so much. It's just, if there's one thing that was a little bit nerdy about me growing up, it was my Pokemon love. <laughs> All right, this next one, we're opening it. I got a repeat. I got another Chespin. Of course, I got a Pikachu which is very exciting. Got a Squirtle, which was my starter Pokemon for Leaf Green. I have a Score Bunny, which I've actually never seen this one, but probably also from the newer generation. As you can probably tell, uh, water types were always my go-to. I know a lot of, it's weird, a lot of people like to go with fire types. No one really ever goes grass type. Most definitely gonna try to get another Happy Meal in the future. And it's amazing because I love McDonald's too. It almost made me tear up. Very much my childhood. I can't even describe how happy this makes me. I love it so much. Okie dokie. Set up nine by thirteen. <laughs> yeah, so and now it's my turn, right? I can discard these three at one more. Of a show of affection or favor, and these seem. 